Hi guys, welcome to another video. In today's video, we're going to discuss about how to transfer data from iOS to Android or iOS device. The task of transferring data between smartphones has yet to be universally recognized as a straightforward process. While there are numerous services and methods have introduced the direct transfer of data between devices, continue to present some challenges and it's hectic as well. Well, the solution for all of these problems is Dr. Phone Phone Transfer as it emerges as a solution that addresses the issues comprehensively, offering a very effortless and seamless system to transfer data between all types of phone. Part 1. Transfer data from iOS to Android. Step 1. Launch Phone Transfer Tool. Initiate the process by launching Wondershare's Dr. Phone on the computer. Continue from Toolbox Phone Transfer to redirect towards opening the particular tool. Step 2. Select device as source and destination. As it opens on a new window, the connected iOS device and Android device will be detected by the platform. As they are detected, the data is being detected and loaded on the platform, which is displayed on the bottom of the device. However, it's important for you to define the path for the transfer, thus the selection of source and destination. Use the flip button if needed to change the direction of the transfer which can be between the devices. Step 3. Select Data Types and Transfer. After the selection of the source and destination, continue to select the categories of the data that you want to transfer. Checkmark all the required data types and proceed to tap to start the transfer button. You can also select the option of Clear Data before copy to clear out the existing data in the destination device. Step 4. Turn off iCloud Syncing. Following this, Dr. Phone transfers display to perform a specific operation as shown by the prompt on the window. As it asks you to turn off the iCloud syncing, open the setting of your iDevice and continue to select your name from the top. Proceed from iCloud Photos and continue to turn off the toggle of iCloud Photos on the screen. As a pop-up comes in the display, click the Download Photo and Video option. Step 5. Observe progress of data transfer. Once done, the pop-up window on the front shows the progress of the data transfer. Click Cancel if you wish to stop the transfer. Step 6. Data transfer completes. As the data is transferred successfully, the complete details are displayed related to its completion. Click OK to close down the entire process. Part 2. Transfer data from iOS to an iOS device. Step 1. Set data transfer path on accessing the phone transfer tool. Continue to connect your iOS devices and let them load your data on the next screen. Here define the source and destination of the transfer to specify the direction of the phone transfer. To change the location, you can use the flip button on the top right. Step 2. Choose data types. After the successful determination of source and destination, continue to select the particular data types that you look forward to transfer. Checkmark all the data and select the transfer to proceed with the operation. Step 3. Turn off Find My Feature. Once done, a prompt appears on the front asking you to turn off the Find My Feature on the iOS devices. Open the settings of the iOS device and proceed further by tapping on the name on the top. Continue from iCloud to Find My Feature and turn it off. Step 4. Observe Phone Transfer Progress. As you turn off the feature, the data transfer initiated and a progress bar will clearly display the completion of the process. Step 5. Completion of iOS to iOS phone transfer. Once done, the window in the front shows the completed phone transfer. Click OK to conclude the entire process. Well, that's it for today's video. So please let us know if you have any other question or if you have any specific requirement. We will try to make sure to make a video on that. So go now and comment below and share your feedback. Please hit the icon button so you will be notified about all the new videos that we are uploading continuously. That's it for today's video. See you in the next one.